Hi, so today I want to show a little bit of my Nintendo Switch collection. Most of the games are shoot em ups. And uh, we can start with Ikaruga. This one is still sealed, I have not played it yet. Uh, Ghostbleed HD is also a shoot em up. Uh, Danmaku Bullet Tell. And it's also still sealed. Dan Mark One Limited 3 is also a shoot em up. Many shoot em ups here. Uh, Rolling Gunner, fantastic shoot em up. I have also it for PC. This is the Raiden uh, Mikado Remix Collection. Uh, re e yeah, there, it's not a collection, but I got confused because uh, Limited Run has released now um, a collection with both Raiden 4 and 5. I bought this a uh, long time ago, never played it. Unfortunately, time is not so much to play old games. Uh, Cotton Fantasy, that is uh, Cotton Rock and Roll, I think, in the Japanese version. Cotton Guardian Force Saturn Tribute. Two Cotton games released for the Sega Saturn, plus Guardian Force, that is also a shoot em up. Cotton Reboot, I don't remember which Cotton is this. This is a procedural shoot em up. Uh, that uh, that means that every time you start a new stage, um, the weapons and the, the pattern of the enemies are different. Don't really know if I like it. Just played five minutes. Not particularly into it. I'm not a big fan of uh, procedural games. This is Razion X by NGDev Team. It's a game that I had uh, before for the uh, as a MVS and uh, sold it. I wanted uh, two copies, I usually buy two copies of games that I really like. Uh, here is Star Hunter DX, this one is also a shoot em up, never played it, two copies also of this. Mushime Sama, the famous cave, cave game, also two copies, Dead Smiles, I have actually also two copies of this, but the one is Japanese and it's not here with me now. Demon Trotto, there is a video that did an unboxing on my channel. Shoot em up box. This is Esplarade by Cave. Basara is also a new shoot em up. Shoot em up collection, never played, still sealed. This is a new Super Lucky Tail, it's a 3D platform, sealed. Xeno Crisis, this is a, a top uh, 2D shooter like uh, Smash TV. In that style, you got a Lily. It's a, a it's also a platformer, 2D platformer. Obu is a Metroidvania. This is amazing Valfaris. I played this and I finished it. Amazing game. Love the game of this um, uh, developer. Super Mario 3D All Stars, Hori and the Blind Forest, or in the Will of Wisps, Blaster Master Zero. Bought but never played. Wild Guns Reloaded, this is uh, a remake of a game uh, done for the Super Nintendo. Donkey Kong, uh, Donkey Kong Country, uh, just started this one. Uh, this is also a very good game. Uh, Extermination Force is a shoot em up uh, run and gun. Hollow Knight, Metroidvania, very famous. Blackbird, this is also a good uh, shoot em up. Uh, the Elder Scroll is, uh, yeah, you know, what is it? Um, this is kind of Mega Man game. This is a platformer, not a particularly good one. Battle Axe. I founded this game on Kickstarter because I love the pixel art of um, the artists, but uh, the game is not so good. I've never, I've never played it, but I've seen some videos. I'm not really impressed by it. Wonder Boy, great game. Uh, this is a remake of the Master System, and this one is the the new game. Also very good. Yoshi Crafted World, never played. This is also a kind of Mega Man game. 
Super Mario Odyssey, Blazing Crew, uh, I love, absolutely love um, um, Joy Mesher games, so I love this one, and I love also, I, there, there should be a collection of other two games, Odalus and Donica, uh, somewhere else here. Toki Tori Collection, this is a puzzle game, played it pretty good, not uh, very, not exceptional, but uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's quite fun, if you like the genre. Uh, Blue Stain, one and two, two, two Castlevania games. This is our type. Um, uh, yeah, the the shoot 'em up. Freedom Planet, a kind of Sonic clone. Decent. Gunlord X by MG Dev, great uh, Turrican uh, inspired game clone. Come on, uh, yeah, clone uh, can can one say? Legend of Zelda, Celeste. Uh, this is a very acclaimed game, but uh, I played it, finished it, but. Uh, I'm not a very f a big fan of it. It's a good game, but not a masterpiece, as people used to say. The Messenger, it's a Metroidvania. Quite good, but uh, I prefer Shadow uh, Shadow Warrior. I don't remember the exact name, but uh, uh, yeah, there is a, a new game that uh, is also with a ninja, but uh, it's more action in the NES. A kind of Ninja Gaiden, modern Ninja Gaiden, I don't remember the name right now, I'm waiting still for the physical release. Fox and Forest, it's a, a platform action, mm, not very good. Momodora is a kind of terrible, uh, I didn't like it, uh, Metroidvania. This is a very, this this is a good one, it's a Madeline, it's a clone of um, Ghost and Goblins, but it's not the first version that was uh, crappy. This one is better, and uh, it's more just arcade, there is no campaign, uh, com uh, yeah, campaign uh, game. Uh, the best version of this game is probably the one for the X-Arcadia, yeah, but uh, this one is uh, second on the list. Time Spinner, this is a good uh, Metroidvania, I liked it. Agalos also very good. Iconoclast also very good Metroidvania. Blasphemous also. also. Oh, this is also by Joy Master. The collection I, I uh, see before. I, and uh, yeah, it's also very good. Toki is the arcade game. I like it. Ultra Core, I also the Mega Drive version. Wonder Boy, Asha. I played the original one. Uh, not not play this one yet. Panzer Paladin is also also a good game. Uh, Slain, I uh, I love as I said the uh, Valkyries that is the se the sequel, uh, but uh, never played this one. Crix is a puzzle game. Tanuki Justice is also a, an action game. I like this kind of games. I have to try it. Uh, Castlevania Anniversary Correction, Deponia. De I'm not a big fan of uh, point and click adventures, but I liked uh, Deponia. Uh, Shanty Games, I just missed one that uh, never got it. I have to to buy it, but uh, yeah, it's not in my priority list right now. Train Series, this is an exclusive of uh, the USA. It's uh, kind of rare, I think. Oh, Mega Man 11, I have actually the collection of all the Mega Mans, but it's not here. And uh, yeah, some more games that I want to get rid of. This one is The Witcher 3 that I played and finished it. Like it, but uh, once you played it, uh, I'm not. Uh, I'm not very. Uh, I don't think I will play it again in the future. Same thing for Dark Souls Remastered. Really liked it, but um, don't think we'll play it again. Who Explorer Edition is a good, good. Decent uh, 3D platformer, same thing, will not play it again. Uh, Vitamin Connection is still sealed. I bought it, but uh, it's not really my kind of games. Don't know why I bought it, honestly. Cube 2, I played it, finished it. It's a decent puzzle game. And uh, yeah, this is for the Mega Drive. We These are games that I have to sell. And uh, here we have, uh, oh, this is, the, I love this game, Curse of Castilla, it's, uh, I have two copies of this. This is Yoga Lady, have to play it, not played yet. 
this is finished, great game, one of the best uh, 2D platformers I've played recently. Teeny Barbarian is also an excellent game, very underrated in my opinion. This is also quite good, it's a Zelda clone initially released for the Apple uh, devices. This is uh, oh, this, um, Kiki Kai Kai. Uh, honestly, I'm not very impressed by this release. I hope for a better game. I don't know why, it's not bad, but uh, uh, I prefer the Super Nintendo version. Metroid Dread, very good Metroid. Marsupilami, it's a, a kind of a Donkey Kong uh, Country clone. Pretty short, no boss fights, but uh, otherwise pretty good. Undown is an action game, uh, uh, a running gun. It's uh, quite good also, I liked it. Kaze is uh, also Donkey Kong green, a game, clone. It's good. Flynn is a metroidvania. Not played yet, uh, and some beta maps that uh, I've not played. The Takeover, Double Dragon Neon, this old limited run, crap. And Clockwork Aquaria, that uh, is at best a decent game, but it's arcade, and I like that kind of those kind of games, so I want to, to try it. And uh, that's it.